Hi all. Today we will discuss about how to change the color of thickest values. How to change the color of thickest values dynamically or any fixed color within the reports. Okay. So once you log in, so we get this home page. Then so if you go to if you have thickness values, we will go to accounts. So we will take the rating field. So we have so we have different uh, things, but we will take the rating field. So we have three thickness values, which means hot, warm, and cold. So we have three thickness values. So here these values are assigned dynamically. Normally, if you want any color to be represented in the reports. So we can change here. So we we'll click on this edit. So we'll select a value. Then here, see here, we have normally the chart color is assigned dynamically, but we need a, a different color. So I will keep this red for this part. Want save. You can edit other value. If you want any any particular color for this, we have to work this way. Otherwise, the colors will be automatically assigned dynamically when we create a chart with thickness values. So I need this I blue for this for one. We will edit the third one also. We take this for So here, so we have taken three different colors for three different thickness values. Right? So now we will go with reports. On reports. Click on new report. So we will create the report for accounts. Click accounts. On the right side, click on start report. So what are the fields we need? So we can use all names. So click on the subject review automatically when you uh, select the fields, it will come here automatically. So filters here, select all accounts, apply. In the filters, in the filter section, in the accounts, you have select all the accounts. So create a date, it should be like all time. So we will get all the records in the accounts, apply.
Go to filters, the accounts, it should be all accounts. Apply. This will be all time. Okay. So we have the all the accounts. So go to outline, we can make it quite account to honor. So what that would be the name? So we So here, so we will group by rating. So this is the thing. So click on this add chart here. On the top, you have like add chart, right? Click on this add chart. So we will change the chart to a donuts. You can clearly see the colors now. Yes. So once we go to this pick list values, uh, for pick list value hot, it is red. So we got the red here. So this is rating is false. For this one, it's like sky blue for warm. If we click this one, yes, this is rating one. So if we go to cold, it's brown. So this is rating is cold. So this is how we change colors. If you want any fixed colors, we will do like this. So if you want to change dynamically, so in this case, automatically we have that one chart colors, right? So we will edit this one. So with this one. So click on this here, we have to click on this assign color dynamically. Yes, save it. Color. Assign color dynamically, save. Color dynamically, so so we have colors, the same colors to values dynamically. Okay, Yes, so if we repeat this sheet, we can see that we save this one.
Click on add chart. So here in the settings box, that properties. So we will select the donut. See, earlier we have uh, red, sky blue, and brown. So now these values are assigned dynamically. Means it, it will take the system colors. Whatever the system gives, it takes the colors. So we will see it now. So. So if you see these colors are dynamically assigned by the system itself. So if you want to edit these colors, if there are, if there are more thickness values, we cannot add for each and everything. If we need any specific colors for one or two records, like one or two thickness values, if they are important. So if you want to change only those two colors, so you can like edit this one. So this is the thing. So if you want to like, if you want to need any specific color, so so we have to go to the picklist values. So if you need, so here we will change color. So here we have to have options. Assign colors to values dynamically. Assign fixed colors to all values. Assign fixed. So, so before clicking on that, we have to change the color so like for this part we will give an yellow color so maybe for one we will give a different color So we will, so in this chart, we have taken assign fixed colors to all values. So, so we have changed the values for all the values. See, we have given a specific color to this, not assign dynamically, we have given a specific color. So now we will go to, um, once refresh this chart, refresh.
See, now the colors are changed to green, yellow, and this one, right? So this is how we can change the picnic values colors in reports. If you want a, um, a different colors other than the system colors, we can assign our, our colors to the picnic values. Thanks, guys.